Wildcats knew their first ever trip to the fourth round would present many challenges in game one. Yesterday, they faced a pitcher going to Texas. They scored three runs off of him and even scored the first run of the game. In game two, they'll take on a pitcher going to Texas A&M. Another tough challenge for the Sabercats. However, they feel pretty confident going into game two. One reason is they get to play right here at home. Games two and three, if necessary, will be played at UTRGV. Big advantage, I feel, is uh, representing not only Vela High School, the community, our administration, and our student athletes and athletes here in the schoolhouse. It's just having representing the Valley as a whole and playing at our local university in, in such a nice venue that we're going to play in. In game one, the Sabercats committed a couple of errors that were costly in their 7-3 to three loss against the Chargers. What we're trying to do right now is just tell our guys to come out and compete, you know, and whoever they put on the mound is whoever it is. You know, you don't get here by accident. Knowing to get to this level, you got to have good quality pitching, play great defense, and throw strikes, and, and to give yourself a chance. One, two, three, so yes. First pitch for tomorrow's game two between Bella and Churchill set for 1 p.m. at UTRGV. Reporting in Edinburgh, Ruben Juarez, Channel 5 Sports.